You start? No. <laughs> you can start. All right. <laughs> I'm Alicia. I'm Jordan. And we have been married for over four years now. over in Ohio um, at a, a church function. Um, we kind of knew that we were meant for each other and, and, and prayed about it and, and just kind of fell in love with each other. And, and then we moved to Indiana and um, that was where we were when we got married and have started to build our family um, in Indiana and hope to grow our family some more. Family is huge for us. Uh, we are always with, with the extended family and, and spending that time together. Um, so we, we enjoy being around kids and um, we've always wanted to, to, continue our, or to continue to grow our family um, and move, move along with that. And A few months after we were married um, was when we first kind of talked about let's start trying to grow our family, let's try to have some kids. and. Um, about a year um, after I went to the doctor and I was diagnosed with PCOS and found out that it was going to be more difficult um, to become pregnant and then um, to carry full term. So we um, started meeting with doctors and we did um, five um, IUI attempts with um, fertility medications and um, when they all failed we did it with two different doctors. Um, we decided it was time to take a break. Um, it was kind of a letdown after five failed attempts. So um, we prayed a lot um, and talked a lot about it and just kind of tried to find out what our next step was going to be. And that was when we really felt God was calling us to adoption that um, bringing a child into our family through adoption was just what he wanted us to do at the time. Whenever, whenever we go to Ohio, we always make a point to hang out with everyone and um, just continue to grow that um, relationship with everyone. And um, my brother actually adopted um, uh, a little boy from Africa, so uh, adoption's definitely been on our radar, and we got to see that side of things. And um, we love spending time with them. Continue to uh, to pursue the adoption with all the different avenues so uh, we just love being able to spend the time with the family um, yeah. um, growing up I with my uh, mom and dad and two brothers I'm the middle child and um, so I played a little bit of everything um, cops and robbers and then I would talk them into playing house with me so I had a lot of fun with my brothers. We have always been close and had that, um, that close friendship. Um, we were really the only ones that lived close by. We didn't have other kids to play with, so it was just the three of us. We stuck together playing outside a lot. Um, and so we have continued having that friendship growing up. and. Um, I was raised in a Christian family um, and still continue to hold those values um, close and will continue to hold those values with our family as we grow. So with my love for children, um, after college I decided to be a live-in nanny and so for three years um, I got the chance to um, take care and love on three kids. For three years I got the chance to help raise them and make an impact on their lives that um, is something I will never forget. Um, I still have great relationship with the th uh, three of them and have been able to watch them grow. Um, it's been amazing to go back to Ohio and visit them, um, to have them as part of our wedding, to just have them as part of our lives. We've actually been able to have them come stay with us for a weekend in Indiana. And so that's been fun um, to just see them grow from, you know, before they were two to um, almost 10 now. <laughs> So it's, it's a wonderful experience. Um, we have both um, always loved kids. We have built great relationships with our nieces and nephews and um, invite them over for sleepovers, um, take them to movies, and just love to hang out with them. And 
So growing up with that passion for kids, we both knew that um, we would definitely have kids together um, one day. And um, so that, that love and passion will be there for our child. Um, when, when we have a child, it, it will definitely be a child that is loved, um, and not just by us, but by our extended family. Um, our parents and our siblings are so excited to welcome a new child into our family, and I think they're just about as anxious about it as we are. Yes, and they are very anxious <laughs> with, with the whole process. Uh, they can't wait for it to, to be over and to be able to love on that child. We just um, thank um, you for taking the time to consider us as um, the parents of your child um, and know that that child will be loved and will not forget about the sacrifice that you made um, in knowing that this was the best choice for your child. Um, so we just hope that you'll, you will see the love and the joy that we have in being able to be the parents for your child. No, we look forward to being able to grow that relationship with you um, and make sure that you are still a part of the child's life and just thank you for, for taking the time to consider us.